Mary Oliver, the water pool. For all they said, I could not see the water pool until I came and saw the water falling, its laced legs and its womanly arms sheeting down while something howled like thunder over the rocks, all day and all night, unspooling, like ribbons made of snow or God's white hair. At any distance, it fell without a break or seam, and slowly, a simple preponderance, a fall of flowers, and truly it seemed surprised by the unexpected kindness of the air and light-hearted to be flying at last. Gravity is a fact everybody knows about. It is always underfoot. Like a summons, gravel back the muscle in every beetled basin and imagination. That striver, that third eye, can do a lot, but hardly everything. The white, scrawled wings of the tumbling water I never could have imagined. Maybe there will be, after all, some slack, perfectly balanced, blind and rough piece. Finally, in the deep and green and utterly motionless pools after all that falling. <laughs>